You don't want a spider like this running out onto the stick that you're using. Hello there explorers and welcome to About Man's Life. It's really good to see you guys. Today we're rehousing Smurf Faith into our new enclosure. So let's hope that everything goes according to plan. Smurfette is my Pocilutheria metallica fema, also known as the Guti ornamental tarantula. If you would like to know more about this species, look at the info card on the top. Smurfette has now outgrown this small enclosure, and it's time to move her to the larger one. So, what will we need to move her? Firstly, we will obviously need the enclosure itself, and we'll need to make sure that it's clean inside as it already is. Then we'll need some kind of a substrate. I prefer feet. It works well, retains moisture, and is sterile, so it's an excellent choice. I will also need a hide or two for this tarantula, in which she can go and hide during the day when she's sleeping, and another piece just to increase the surface area within the enclosure, as this is an arboreal species. And this is what the final enclosure of this tarantula will look like now. You will see that there are two hides. One will be a moist hide and the other will be a dry hide. So, let us begin. Let's first open Smurfette's door and then open the new cage door over that one with the hope that you will run straight into the new cage. A random fact while I'm doing this, one of the best tools that you can use to move a spider with is a long kite stick because it's so thin that the spider can't climb up it which is always an added advantage if you want to move a spider. You don't want a spider like this running out onto the stick that you're using. So one of the things that I can tell you, in a moment like this, the most important thing that you can do is stay extremely calm. Because if you're not calm, you will most probably be bit by the spider. Let us try and move her back into the enclosure without getting bit. Um, let's just try and softly tap this foot over here. That is working excellently. Go in, go in. And he's in her enclosure and we're closing it. Smurfit has successfully been moved. Just 15 minutes after moving Smurfit into her new enclosure, she already decided that the left hide is suitable for her. I suspect that during the night she will walk around exploring the new enclosure. Doing so, she will also be putting down a web. So, despite a few hiccups and a slight problem, we successfully moved Smurfit into her new enclosure. If you haven't done so already, go share this video with your friends and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell. Then remember to explore, discover and share. I will see you explorers next time. Oh, for those of you that watched till the end now, um, there's a small little surprise for you guys. There's two backgrounds that I'm giving away in 4K detail that you can download all for free. Just follow the links down in the description.